Hi folks, co-tutor here and my name is Anil Deshpande. Welcome folks, in this video we will look at destructuring with lambdas. The word destructuring should not be alien to you folks because I have already covered it in the 23rd video of Kotlin Fundamentals series. So if you are not familiar with it, I will just give a quick primer and proceed further. So what is destructuring is all about? Let's assume that you have a data class called as college with the name, affiliation and city. What you can do is you can basically decouple these data that is name, affiliation and city and capture them in another set of variables. So I can write this college with this values that is IIT autonomous dean and Madras and then I can write something like val college name, university affiliation and established city as three separate set of values. So what I did is I destructured the structure. The college was the structure which is a class object and I destructured into three different variables. We can do something like this with lambdas as well and that's what the main reason we are revisiting destructuring here. So let's get into a quick demo. If you see here this is what we have already seen a couple of minutes back and just one more thing what if this class was not a data class and you wanted to implement your own implementation of destructuring nothing serious if you see here it already gives what the solution is it says that create a member function college component one so what you have to do is you have to implement operator functions so for each of these three values that is name, affiliation and city you have to write functions component 1, component 2, component 3 and return whatever that you want to return. So what I would be doing is something like component 1, component 2 and component 3 as you can see the compilation error is still there and then what I will return is return name, return affiliation and return city and that will take care of the compilation error that we were seeing earlier. So if your class is not data class, this is how you solve that compilation error. But let me not do all of that as of now. Let me just declare this particular class as a data class to make my life a little bit easier. Now having said that, let me create a pair. What is a pair? pair is nothing but a key value type of data structure so val uh, nation capital of type pair and let me call it as string comma string so it is a pair of string and string initialize the values say india and then new delhi is the capital and now what i will do is i will create a lambda which will print this and to print it I will use destructuring that's the whole point of this demo so what I will do is well print nation capitals it takes a pair of type string and string and I don't want to return anything I just want to print and what I will do is right so pair print I will write something like pair dot first apostrophe s or should I put it in a better way? So let me do that. Pay dot first capital is pair dot second. So the pair dot first and pair dot second is destructuring in its essence. So whatever the parameter that you are passing, that will basically be destructured into first and second. And now if I just print national capitals and pass the national capital pair and run this it is going to print me India's capital is New Delhi and this kind of destructuring comes in very handy and makes your code a little bit more elegant so let me add a couple of more nation states here so now I can create a list of these pairs well list of nations equals to list of pair containing string and string and 
we can pass the national character one two three and just observe how elegant it becomes list of nations for each print national capitals so that's it it will automatically print all the nation and capital quickly so this is the advantage of using lambdas to destructure and work with the pairs so that's it in this particular video we will meet in the next video exploring lambdas in a much more detailed manner take care that brings us to the end of this particular video don't forget to like comment share the video and subscribe to the channel take care bye